Hey guys, so today I thought I would do a top five Casa Rex products. And also I've got a few that I recommend avoiding if you can. So I'm going to start with my number one favorite Casa Rex product, which is their Triple C Liquid Lightning. Love it. Very, very pure form of vitamin C. Uh, it's basically got two ingredients in it and uh, very efficient, works well. Uh, affordable, I think it's around $30. However, it's very, very pure. So you want to use it up right away, right when you get it. So don't store it if you can. Use it right away because it's very, very good. Um, my second favorite Casarex product would be their Ultimate Nourishing uh, Overnight Rice Spa Mask. And a recommendation, if you can watch out for this, uh, certain stores have the new tube packaging. However, some stores still have it packaged in the jar. And the, pa the difference is astounding because I got these right around the same time. And uh, the jar, as you can see in there, it's just starting to separate and go bad really fast. So uh, certain stores carry the tube, certain stores just carry the jar. Pick up the tube if you can. Uh, and if they only have it in the jar packaging, don't get it. Shop somewhere else. That's my recommendation for that. So love it, though. Very hydrating. Uh, works well overnight. Use it over everything else and then let it soak in. So uh, another favorite of mine is their Centella Water Alcohol-Free Toner. I use this kind of as a face mist and also as kind of a uh, toner where I spray it on a cotton pad and then uh, wipe it over my face just to remove any residue. But it works well for both uses and uh, also just to kind of rehydrate your skin during your routine. So love it. Very good product. Uh, their uh, Ultimate Moisturizing Honey Mask is also a good one. This one also comes in a jar or a tube. Uh, so whenever you can, get the tube again. So uh, it works very well. It's lightly hydrating, so if you have more oily skin... Uh, I would probably recommend this one as opposed to the uh, Rice Nourishing Spa Mask. So this one works very well. I like to use it on my neck because it gets very sensitive, but also has a lot of good propolis in there. So very good and beneficial for your skin. Uh, Costarex makes a lot of good uh, alpha hydroxy and beta hydroxy acid toner treatments. My favorite is their AHA BHA toner, their uh, clarifying treatment toner. Works very well. A little bit goes a very long way, so my first ball is last, I think, like six or seven months. So use this just like a toner spray on a cotton pad and then uh, massage it over your skin. So it works very well to get rid of dead skin cells and uh, also helps to kind of clear up blackheads or any potential breakouts. So it works very well. really like that one. Um, so that was my top five. I've got a couple other ones I also really like. Uh, their Aloe Soothing Sun Cream is a pretty good sunscreen. Uh, it does have a little bit of uh, fragrance in there, but uh, for the most part, it works very well under makeup foundation. It's also uh, lightly hydrating. Uh, their newer, this one is their uh, Balancium uh, Comfort Ceramide Cream. Works very well. It does have a little bit of fragrance in there, so if you're going to use this, I recommend using it at night. Uh, because of the uh, fragrance component in there. But I like this actually better than the Dr. Jart uh, Ceramide product. So I really like that one. Their low pH, uh, no, yeah, low pH BHA overnight mask is good occasionally, just when my skin is super dry, but it is very, very thick and uh, can be a little bit pore clogging. So I don't use it that often, but if my skin's feeling super dry, uh, I like to go with that one. Uh, some of their other products that are decent, their Hyaluronic Hydra Pow Power Essence is a good one. Uh, their Galactomyces 95 Toner, which I did a versus of this and the SK2 Toner. Uh, this one's a good one, though. If you're into the ferments and things like that, it's a good affordable option. So, also very good. And their 2-in-1 Poreless uh, Toner is also okay. I just prefer their other ones to this one, so... Also decent. Uh, this one didn't really fit on the list anywhere, but their low pH uh, Good Morning Cleanser is awesome. Very gentle, especially for morning. It doesn't do a lot for like makeup removal because it's more of a uh, low pH cleanser, but it works well just to remove any residue, sebum, things like that. Um, their Light Fit Toner, I wasn't a huge fan of this one. Uh, it just didn't do much for me. I prefer their other toners to it, but... Uh, still a decent product package very well, but it does have a little bit of fragrance in there. So uh, let me get to the few I would recommend avoid. Oh, I should mention their snail products are awesome. I'm working on my top five snail list. So uh, 
any of these, these are all pretty good too. I just couldn't fit them all into my top five. I should have done like a top ten. But anyway, I don't know. Five is usually a little bit better. Um, anyway, so the ones I would recommend avoiding, their Shield Fit Snail Essence Sun has a lot of denatured alcohol and a lot of fragrance in there. And you can smell the alcohol right when you use it. So this one just isn't the best sunscreen. If you're looking for a good sunscreen and want to buy Casa Rex, go with their Aloe Smoothing Sun Cream. Or their Shield Fit All Comfort Sun Essence is or sun cream. This one's a little bit better, but it still has a little bit of fragrance in there, so I still would not highly recommend it, but uh, it's there's better ones out there. So their oil-free ultra moisturizing lotion, I know a lot of people really like it. Uh, I would recommend if you use this to use it at night because it does contain some fragrance and some drying uh, ingredients. So if you have very sensitive skin, this is not going to be the best option for you. However, if you have uh, Oily skin, I know a lot of people that have more oily skin tend to like this one a little bit better, but uh, if you have dry skin, it's just not the best option. So, And then their uh, Cooling Aqua Facial Mist really doesn't do anything to add to your skincare routine. Uh, it's got some fragrance in there and not a ton of beneficial ingredients. So if you're looking for a face mist, uh, I would highly recommend using their Centella Water, which is a better alcohol-free, fragrance-free uh, face mist. So... Uh, those are the couple I'd re recommend avoiding. Their blemish cream is good. Uh, use it as a spot treatment. Don't use it all over because that's why I didn't like it initially. And their uh, hydrogel pads are fun. Uh, again, I recommend using them at night. They have a little bit of fragrance in them. So if you're using them at night, it's not going to be a huge issue. But overall, those are kind of my favorites and not so favorites of Casa Rex. So I'm interested in what yours are. So leave a comment. I'd love to see them create like a foundation or a beauty balm. That would be awesome. So or maybe some lip products. I don't know. I guess we'll see. So anyway, leave a comment and thank you guys so much.